Hamster combats will not pay you if you are not doing this. Now there are lots of things you need to take into consideration on your hamster combat account in order to even keep it safe so that it won't get banned. As you all know, this airdrop is actually coming to an end gradually and is going to be finalized this month. So we need to be very careful at this month. Now the first step you need to take here is to ensure that you've connected your wallet. That is the first thing you need to take into consideration. I'm going to list out three more things you need to take into consideration in this video in order to keep your account safe. You're welcome to the Friday channel. I make videos on how to make money and how to fix app related issues. So if you are seeing this channel for the first time, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and notification bell as well in order to get updated whenever I upload helpful videos like this. Alright guys, so let's simply dive right into the video. Now the second thing you need to take into consideration here is to avoid auto clickers. A lot of you guys are still using auto clickers, knowing fully where that this airdrop is going to be launched this month. Now, Hamster Combat is banning a lot of accounts that are using the auto clickers. So, you need to avoid the use of auto clickers for now in order to keep your account safe. Now, the next thing you need to take into consideration as well in order to keep your account safe is to avoid the use of bot cheating. Now you notice that a lot of you guys are using bot in order to generate friends on hamster combat, which is not advisable. So if you're actually using bots to generate friends on hamster combat, you should actually avoid it at all costs in order to keep your account safe so that your account won't be among those that are going to be suspended or banned from using hamster combat. Because hamster combat can actually identify those using bots in order to generate friends very easily and they are going to ban those accounts. So you should be careful at this period. Also, you need to avoid using multiple accounts on one device. Now, the use of multiple accounts is not actually wrong, but having multiple accounts of hamster combat on one device is actually wrong. And the hamster combat is banning those who are using multiple accounts in one device. Now, if you're using multiple accounts in one device, they can easily see it. They also know those that are using it. So they are going to ban those accounts. Now, hamster combat is seeing those that has multiple accounts and they might end up banned in the admitted module. So it is advisable to eat those accounts and leave just one on your device. If you're using multiple accounts in different devices, that is a different case all on its own now using multiple accounts on different device is not actually wrong but using multiple accounts on one device is actually wrong and hamster combat is going to identify those accounts and get it banned and most importantly you should ensure that your wallet is connected here if you don't know how to do that i've made videos on how to do that I'm going to leave the videos on the description as well. So you are going to be able to connect it. So as to be able to receive your hamster token on your Tor wallet once hamster gets to launch. All right, guys, this is all you need to do in order to keep your hamster combat account safe so that it won't get banned and so that you'll be able to receive your hamster token on your Tor wallet once they get to launch. Alright, we've come to the very end of this video. Do it to smart like button, subscribe and hit notification bell. Tell me in the comment section if this video was helpful to you. And tell me as well if you are still having any problem related to this video. I wouldn't hesitate to give you feedback as soon as possible. Thanks for watching and bye for now. See you in my next video.